Hey guys, Deplorable Deb. I want to talk about something because you know when something bothers me, I'm going to bring it up. I want to know where is the uh, gay community or what you call it, the LGBT? Why is it that um, it's okay for Chelsea Hammer to come out with a tweet to Lindsey Graham, you know, a Republican politician, and the the tweet was so bad that they can't really post it. And, you know, I'm not even going to repeat, but she actually used the word, um, you know, sucking D. Do you understand what I'm saying? And what I'm not understanding is why is why aren't any person, okay? I'm not even saying liberal or uh, Republican. Why isn't anybody for basic morals to come out and say, this is wrong. Even if you support her, like I said, I'm not asking for Trump supporters. I'm not asking for Republicans. I'm not saying liberals, but I'm not understanding. Where is the gay community to allow something like this without going after her and calling her out? It should not be acceptable because she's a comedian or so-called comedian that she should turn around regardless of what people think about him. But to me, she's, she's sort of outing somebody. And I thought that's unacceptable. And you know what gets me mad? And I'm a gay woman myself, but what gets me mad is why anybody with morals would let this happen it should not be about party right now it should be about morals and what's getting me is who who is just gonna sit by and say this is okay especially gay people when when we don't like it when it's done to us and it shouldn't be oh because he's a republican it's okay for her to do that or, you know what? He's a Democrat, so it's okay to do that to him. It should not be acceptable from anybody. The problem that I see is why is it that there's so much hate, hatred, and when anybody comes out to speak, we're attacked. See, that's what gets me. Now, if we want to go with her party, she's this liberal. So here we go again. The attacks, like she can't just write a tweet and say, you know what, I didn't like what you what you did or whatever, but the derogatory, what she said is disgusting. The same way that people see when Robert De Niro was at some Hollywood thing. But you know what? When I watched the clip of it, what I really saw is that he wasn't getting the, su the support that he thought he was going to get. And why is it okay that he can stand up there and use the vulgarity that he was using and nobody shut him down? But as soon as our president uses a word, it becomes racist and, ev and you go against him. That's what I'm not understanding. When is this going to end? That that's when is it going to stop? And when is it going to stop with the mainstream media? I've never seen something like this. Why is it that we're not just having a news that is for both? That is just going to put out news. What's happening now is is we're literally getting up turning the TV on, and we're seeing a bunch of people that are allowed now to give a voice, and it's totally, they're getting away with bashing the president. And it's disgraceful. Where is the morals? Regardless of you not liking him, there should still be respect. And this is what's happening now. But again, if this was Obama, right, none of this would be going on. Look what happened at that, I think, a bullfight when some clown put on an Obama mask. The guy was fired. Uh, we don't even know what happened to the guy. But all I keep.
keep seeing is every time there's an attack on our president, these people are getting away with it. And I don't know, and I'm telling you, I want to know if the gay community is going to call her out. Regardless if she's a liberal like you or a Democrat, it should be unacceptable because you, the, you know, this is what gets me is the, is a, the, the whole logic of being a liberal is where people shouldn't be attacked. You don't like it. You don't like it when people that that's the, the liberal ideology that people should be able to, to be free and do whatever. But you know what? It's only your, it, it's just okay that you guys could attack. Or even when it comes to something that a person don't like what I'm saying, they can't just say, you know, deplorable Deb, I disagree with you. But no, they got to start with the insults. That's a shame. And, and Chelsea, Chelsea, uh, Chelsea Hammer just proved it. Handler, whatever her name is, she just proved it. She proved that she thinks she could just say what she wants. And she's not going to be called out. Now, here's another thing. What I find funny. I, f I find this funny. I find funny is that they're all mad about the president supposedly calling Haiti or San Salvador or Ecuador or whatever shitholes. But you, you know what's getting me? Why are you guys the ones that are supporting DACA? Why is it that you don't want them to leave? See, here's the proof in the pit in the pudding. You don't want them to leave because of what? What are the things I've been reading? That it's unfair that they go back to a country that has such poor conditions. What does that say? You people, you people are calling over there, Haiti or whatever that they're coming from, shitholes. That's exactly, because if it wasn't shitholes, you guys, the liberals and Democrats, wouldn't be mad if they're being sent back. But the truth to the matter is, you want them here for votes. For votes. Because that's all what this is about. See, it cracks me up. You get mad at the president because of third world or whatever, but it's you guys too that call over there a third wor world. What about Obama in 2014, what he called Libya a shit show? How about some other Republicans? Like I think Leslie Graham, am I saying his right? Lindsey Graham, whatever. He called them hell holes. But it's funny that they want to fight and make a big boo-hoo that even the word shithole is racist, that they don't want these people to leave, but yet, in reality, they're admitting that they don't want them to go back to San Salvador because it is a shithole. The mayor even said, what am I going to do with 200,000 people when we're being overrun by MS-13? To me, that's a shithole, isn't it?